my mom. Um, she started in nursing in 1968 as an LVN. I remember wearing her cap as a three-year-old. She worked for many years as an LVN. She became an RN. Um, she ran DFW Medical Center. She was fabulous. And I wanted to serve people like she did. When I first went to nursing school in 1985, um, my daughter passed away while I was in my core. She was three years old and it was a very hard hit. I finally got to a point where I could go back and had applied and was ready for core and my middle son um, died as a victim of suicide. After about eight months, I picked up my bootstraps and said, okay, let's do this. And I went back and um, about a year into it, when I was ready to apply again, my stepson died. Six months later, I was ready to go again and then COVID hit. And I was so sad because I was finally there. And then WCU sent me a letter and they were online. And now I'm here. I believe I was raised that way. My grandmother was a nurse, my mother was a nurse, my great-grandmother was a nurse, and our job was to take care of other people, not just as nursing, but people in need. I opened a nonprofit dance studio, and I've been teaching dance to underprivileged children for 25 years. Many got scholarships into colleges and things, and I just wanted to give to those kids a chance. Please do not give up. Please do not give up hope. There is always hope at the end of the tunnel. If I can do this with burying three children, my husband had a stroke, my mother had a stroke, I lost my car, I lost my job. There are plenty of things that I haven't told you that happened during that time. But if you will have faith in the tenacity, you can do anything that you want to do and people will support you and help you. So go to nursing school, finish nursing school, build your dream.